What's up guys, John from Heavy Set Tactical here and I would like to take a second. I'm going to do a short review today because I just got a couple minutes uh, to kill. And I wanted to throw a review up for a couple days now since I got two knives uh, from Joker. Joker knives are very affordable, very durable. Uh, you know, there's a lot to say about them. Um, but. I want to bring up just a couple of things real fast. Uh, you know, I have some some specs here, so it's really hard to actually get a nice page of specs for the Joker Nomad. So this is the Joker Nomad, and man, what a gorgeous knife! Nice and thick. You know, this is their wood processing full handle knife. Uh, again, you can see Joker Nomad Bowler uh, N695 and then Spain. So the N6 Bowler N695 steel is the type of steel on this knife. And then the, the maker, J. Sabater. Now I don't have any Spanish made knives in my collection. So this one is actually really special to me. Um, it's a full size, uh, five inch blade. So 10 inches overall. Uh, and I also wanted to bring up just a couple more facts. Um, it's actually really hard to get a nice fact page about these knives, so it, it, it's really strange. They they're hard to hard to find. Can't get them on Blade HQ, sadly. So it is a 1.1 pound uh, knife, and it's made by Joker Knives. It's the Joker Nomad, 10 inches overall, five inch satin finish, Bowler N695 steel, black canvas micarta handle, full tang. Uh, it's got the lanyard hole. Um, it's got black a black paracord on it, and then a black leather sheath. And it's a full tang knife. It has a blade type on it that I really, you know, it's got this semi drop point. It's it's so strange. It has like one of the guys I love watching is Gideon's Tactical. I talk about this guy's videos a lot. He puts this knife just through its paces, and I'm telling you, the Bowler N695 steel is a great uh, bush crafting and wood processing. It's going to hold a great edge. It's nice and hard. It's not going to it's got not going to rust or uh, wear very easily. Um, but yeah, these knives are just extremely, extremely beautiful, and it's great for a nice full handed guy. The uh, the width. The thickness of the handle is about um, about an inch. I think it's like 0.9. Now, I can't seem to... Let me see real quick. When I type it in, Joker Nomad Blade Thickness. I can find weird facts on it. So it's a 5 millimeter uh, is the thickness. Um, and it's really funny because I, I find different numbers and different... Uh, measurements on it. Uh, it. It's really strange, actually, because it's not one of those knives I can pull a spec page up on at Blade HQ. So again, J. Sabater, Joker Knives. This is the Joker Nomad. Love it. Double stitching on the sheath. Nice handmade sheath. Only thing that's stupid is the buttons here. I haven't had them pop, pop yet, but you know, I've, I, I'm sure in the right shitty situation they could pop off, which is a problem for some. I still love it. Seats really great in there. Uh, just a beautiful knife. So that is the Nomad. Then I ordered its little brother. This is the Campero. And it's the 3 inch equivalency of this knife. Now this is a, a Woodscraft bush, Bushcraft, you know, camp, camp knife, right? For wood processing and feather sticking and all sorts of things. And it's got this great big belly. You know, so you can do some uh, batoning for sure. This is more or less your skinning and cutting and camp task basic three three inch version of it. Um, now, here I'm gonna I wanna lay them both out together just so you can see them. Again, this is a an unprepared short review, um, and this blade is actually, it's significantly thinner than the Nomad. This is the Campero. And it's actually uh, Sandic 14 C28 N steel. And then this is the Nomad. So, the uh, the Nomad was 
five millimeter. This is uh, three point seven millimeter on the thickness. This is the brown micarta, um, canvas micarta, but just just beautiful knives by this company. So again, this is a super short video. Uh, I I had a couple minutes to spare, and I just wanted you guys to see the. Uh, the, the two blades I got from Joker Knives, again, I don't have any Spanish-made knives, and the blade type, I saw Gideon's Tactical do a review on a couple of these Joker Knives, and some guys from Canada that I, I follow on YouTube, and I really wanted to get them, so I'm going to put them through some paces, and then I'll come back and tell you guys about them in a later video, but this is the Nomad with the Black Micarta, love this knife, and then this is the smaller Campero BS9, you know, good steel, beautiful handles, no transition there, uh, you know, between micarta uh, steel and micarta. They're both full tang, very durable, razor sharp. When I tell you that this is the sharpest knife out of the box that I have ever ordered, I am not BSing you. It is just knockout, man. So I wanted to take just a minute and tell you guys about them. You know, and, and I really like the sheaths that they're made. This is a, a, you know, this is a dangler, and then you could also take the dangler off and use it as a belt knife. And this is just your perfect belt knife, in my opinion. You know, three or f three, three point something inch blade, significantly smaller than the five, but, but perfect belt knife for your your oddball tasks, uh, camp tasks. And then this is your heavier wood processing. You know, both feathers stick well, but uh, but that's definitely more for your wood processing, and you can split with it. It is a hell of a knife. So thanks for watching my channel. Just wanted to take a second to show you guys these knives, and I will come back after I put them through some paces and uh, and give you guys an update. Thanks for watching. Have a good weekend and stay heavy. <laughs> I was in such a rush doing this video, guys. I forgot to tell, say prices, so... The best part about these Joker knives, the big Joker Nomad, uh, the 10 incher, was literally $118. That is a shitload of knife for $118. Now, the Joker Campero, less than 100 It was literally like $92 on Amazon. How in the heck can you get such a great camp knife and such a great bushcraft and survival knife style you know bigger bigger more heavy set style 118 and low 90s so crazy thanks for watching guys have a great weekend stay heavy